This is the video review for Transformers Reveal the Shield Chopster. And as you can see, Chopster is a chopper. Um, here it says Reveal the Shield signing. If you rub that, you will find out that he is a, indeed a Decepticon. He is also a repaint of this guy, Brimstone, from the Hunt for the Decepticons line. He's strictly a repaint. There's no difference. I have not reviewed Brimstone yet, and I will do so in the future, but tonight we're going to be just looking at this guy. Now, uh, Chopster has a kickstand that comes out like this, which is pretty cool because, you know, can kind of lay like that. Then, um, I'm not sure what size, uh, what size action figure could fit on this bike. He's a little too big for the uh, Human Alliance figures, yet he's a little too small for a Star Wars guy. I don't know, maybe like a, a mask figure, maybe? I'm not even sure. But anyway, nonetheless, um, he's really cool and uh, rolls pretty well. Papa Wheelie. <laughs> so anyway, let's get on, uh, let's show some detail here. He's got these panels that move back and forth, and they, uh, kind of some red and yellow highlights here. Uh, the wheels have treads, they're really nice. Lots of nice detail in the engine here. Um, just a really nice, uh, nice, nice uh, Transformer. Also, I'd like to give a shout out to uh, Transformers Fan 300. Uh, I wouldn't have this toy if it weren't for him, so this one's for you, man. And uh, now let's get on to the transformation. Basically, just push the kickstand in. First thing you want to do is come over here and separate this piece like this. And you're going to kind of pull this part like so. Then, come down here, push this piece out, push these two pieces up like so, pull these two pieces up, pull down, and separate. Just like that. Then you want to come along over to this side, pull this down, like so. This piece right here is going to tab into right there. Just like that. And the same on this side. Bring it along, tabs right into place. Okay. Now, next thing you want to do is take the handlebar for both sides of the arm and they go actually in the opposite direction. Like this. Like so. And there's a little claw hand that comes out here. And then this basically detaches like this. And uh, you do the same thing on the other side. Like so. Next thing you're going to do is you're going to take this piece right here, pull this down, like so. Then you're going to turn this piece right here for the head reveal. You're going to take this piece right here, you're going to push it up against his back, like so, while rotating the body. And there we have, and there's really no right or wrong way to do this guy. I kind of like him like this. But you could have him any other way you wanted to with the head. But that's him basically in robot mode. Got great detail, fantastic paint, nice, nice, nice figure. Um, if you already have Brimstone, unless you are a motorcycle enthusiast like I am, because I love toy motorcycles, um, then I guess you could stick with one or the other. I tend to like a little, I like red better than, than blue generally. 
Um, so I would probably try to find Chopster before Brimstone, although Chopster is a lot harder to find because the Reveal the Shield line did not have much of a shelf, later, shelf life at retail due to Dark and the Moon toys leaking out kind of early and um, also because none of the major um, stores in the area or in the, uh, none of the major stores wanted to reorder so, af so soon uh, after the holidays. So they really never got a chance to get put out. I think some stores got the first wave of deluxe classes and that, that was about it. Um, so anyway, um, I give this guy, I don't know, I think I give him a 7 out of 10. He's really cool. Um, he's not as cool as Wind Charger, but very few scout classes are. But he's really, really cool, and he now completes my uh, collection of Reveal the Shield. Anyway, this is uh, first, uh, you know, for size comparison. Uh, I'm trying to think, do I have anything here for size comparison? Um, uh, let's see. No, I guess I, not really. So I'll just let it go at that. Um, I mean, this is a mini con right here. So um, I don't know. He's bigger. He's pretty good size for a scout class. Anyway, um, this is Transy7272 signing off.